back to my channel. So today I am doing a review first impressions demo of the Unique Fiber Lash Mascara. Um, this is $29. I did get this sent to me by one of my sweet subscribers, Jennifer. I will leave her link of everything below in case after this review you want to purchase it. I will say first and foremost, um, I am always 100% honest. So some people might love that about me and then other people might hate that about me because I will be very, very, very honest. So I'm just going to go ahead and start this video. I am going to show you how I apply it and then the comparison between my two eyes. I do have it on this side of my face right now. And um, I'll let you know in the video what I'm wearing on this side. By the way, I don't even know if they call them parties, but I'm not doing anything like, you know, some people will have these parties so you'll buy stuff so they'll get free product and that was not part of the deal with me I was not interested in doing that so um I wanted to put that out there first and foremost so if you do end up ordering from Jennifer you know she gets all of that like I'm not um I'm not trying to sell the product but anyways I'm very, very, very honest in I'm going this. to kind of go into the demo and I do talk through all of the steps with you guys and then I'll come back for my final thoughts on the product here in a second. Okay. So this is a true first impressions and so I'm going to open this with y'all. It still has the plastic on it. Oh my gosh. My scissors are like so dirty. They're sticking together y'all. Okay. And I put my hair back because it would be all up in my face. So it comes in this little, it looks like a little sunglasses kit. And it has this little pamphlet in it. So apply a thin coat of your favorite regular mascara on both sets of lashes. Let dry. I don't really understand that, but whatever. We're gonna go with it. We're gonna apply some mascara. I don't, here's what I don't understand. It feels like too many steps. Like if I'm going to apply my mascara, I might as well just apply my mascara and not everything else. But I'm going to zoom y'all in even closer. Okay. So let's apply our mascara. And this is the Revlon Grow Luscious Mascara, I believe. Which by the way, I've been loving recently. I think I'm just going to do one eye. So, there is, I hope it's in focus, so there is that. Now see, like on a normal day, that would be just fine with me. Like I would just stop right there, girl. Or put on a couple more coats of this. Revlon Bold Lacquer. Okay, next step is... We got to let it dry, girl, and then apply an even coat of the transplanting gel on the lashes. Okay. Um, transplanting gel, which if you haven't seen, the transplanting gel is in a bigger tube. I don't know if that matters, but let's apply the gel, an even coat, okay? I'm like sweating. I'm so nervous. Why am I so nervous? There's the wand. If it will focus, there's the wand. All right, let's apply it, girlfriends. This is the transplanting gel. So fancy with the names. Okay, I will say my eyelashes feel really crunchy right now. I don't know if it's the gel or what's up but they're feeling kind of crispy okay so there's that and then oh my gosh I'm sweating and then um, immediately before the gel has time to dry apply the fibers onto the lashes so here's the fibers and it's so weird let me let it focus hurry up and focus okay so there's the fibers doesn't that look weird let's apply the fibers I'm assuming you just kind of brush them on. Have y'all tried this? Let me know in the comments. Seems like a lot of steps, girl. All right. 
some of my friends have reviewed this and I'm honestly I was very skeptical I think I told y'all that in the intro so they're like coming off in pieces it's kind of like fuzzies all it looks like fuzzies coming and then the girl that sent me this told me to be sure to apply the the fibers at the ends of my lashes that's important apparently okay now what do we do what's step number 50 seriously lastly seal the fibers with another coat of the transplanting gel okay let's seal these babies in and then we'll be able to compare the two eyes now you know what I always see pictures of people comparing one eye with no mascara and then the other eye with this stuff so I'm gonna put on my regular mascara I'm gonna show you with no mascara and this and then I'm gonna show you with my regular mascara and this does that make sense okay I'll be honest it wasn't it's not as spidery as I thought it was gonna be um, if you can see I have some fallout down here which is kind of annoying if you've already done all your makeup but let me let me zoom y'all in okay so this right here is the eye that has the, the eye that has the unique fiber lashes mascara and this is the eye that has nothing on whatsoever so I'm gonna go and put my mascara on this side and then we'll compare so this is the eye that has the unique fiber lash mascara system and this is the eye that has the Revlon bold lacquer grow luscious mascara both are in black and there is the finished product of each eye so I'm going to zoom y'all out and then I will tell y'all what I think okay so let me just say that um do I think this product works well yes absolutely if you want to get the system and it's something that you like and you have someone that you want to support or you want to click on Jennifer's link that's awesome I will say though it wasn't as much of a difference for me to pay $29 for it. You know what I mean? Like literally this was $6.99 at the drugstore. My, the unique eyelashes are a tad bit thicker and um, have a little bit more volume. But this side, it wasn't a $20 difference if you know what I'm saying so I will say this if you have a special event that you are going to and you want to just fancy yourself up and make your lashes vavoom this is a cool product it's actually it's really neat um, how it works and it's really neat watching your lashes build but at the same time I feel like I got pretty close to the same but you know the same volume and length with the other mascara um I did apply two coats of this mascara with nothing else on this eye the unique I did a coat of this mascara and then I did the transforming gel and then I did the fibers and then I did the transforming gel again so for me personally as a mom on the go all the time a lot of times when I work in the mornings I'm kind of in a hurry it's it's too many steps also, if you're somebody who puts your face makeup on first and then your eyes, as you saw in the demo, I don't know if the camera picked it up, but it does, like some of those fibers kind of fall on your face. So those were kind of the downsides. How, sides. However, I do think it's a really, really neat concept and a really, really neat product. I love the way it's packaged. You know what? This would be a very good gift for someone. If you wanted to buy someone, just splurge on them and get them a neat a neat gift a neat packaged gift um it's the inside is really neat i didn't show y'all the inside but it has the unique logo and then right here it has where you kind of slide the mascara in so they don't 
you know fall all over the place so it's a really cool concept it's a really neat package it's kind of like an all-in-one thing so if you're someone who uses a lash primer and then a mascara you might really enjoy this um like I said for me it wasn't that much of a difference um and also, the mascara I used on this side, the Revlon, isn't one of my favorite mascaras. My favorite mascara of all time is Le Volume de Chanel. And if I would have had that on hand, I would have compared the two because I think they would have been exact. I will say, though, the Unique is cheaper than Le Volume de Chanel. But the Le Volume de Chanel is literally one coat on your eyes and you're out the door. So, you know... Um, it's cool. It's a really cool concept, and I'm so glad I got to try it, and I'm, of course, going to use it because it's not something that I'm going to get rid of because I don't like. I just don't know if all of the steps and the additional, you know, kind of work you have to do to build up your lashes is worth it for me. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. The reason I like my channel is because I only want to recommend what I recommend to y'all. You know what I mean? So, um... My subscribers are always, always my loyalty. So, I just wanted to throw that out there. If you've tried Unique and you've had a different experience, let us know in the comments because people read through those comments and people want to know what other people think about it. I hope you all have a wonderful day and I will talk to you soon. Bye.